go to... Wait, 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 don't start it yet, don't start it yet. I don't, I don't, I don't start it yet. I don't have my live stream. Right, well, Plus, I deleted the software since it killed my computer. Okay. So, um. Alright. Uh, 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 uh,
And then the, the there's a thing down here that leads into the back side car, or whatever this thing's called. And, uh, and then this is the back one. So you have the... Yes, Ma! You have the two... Oh, he went, he went somewhere. I don't know where he went. Oh. Excuse me, Jake. So, so you have two... You have the front... The I'll back, be right back. And then the two side cars on the side there. And uh, I don't think there's one at the top. But there is, there is a gunner right here. <laughs> you guys can hear uh, my friend. He's uh, talking to his mom. <laughs> so sorry for him sometimes. Anyways, so I think you can come down here. If we're being realistic, though, there's no way this would ever work. Um, there's just no way to get to anything. It's like you riding where you, go, you where you are, right? Which is a lot of lag. Okay, this is why the computer is meant for stuff like this. For these scenarios. So let's see if we can get this to work. I? Okay, I doesn't do anything. Does it have lights? It does! It does! Alright, let's check out let's check out the uh oh. Uh well that wasn't supposed to happen. Uh alright, well I guess we'll just go over to this side. Ugh. Ah! This is nice. It's nice in here. So, uh... Well, if this were real, I'd want to get out, but I don't think I can. Huh. So... So it looks like everything's just alt-steering. So we'll just reset it real quick. And we'll go all the way back to the back view. Holy crap, this is a big airship. I? I didn't do anything. Okay, so that does that. Alright, so I wonder what... How do I... Action 2. Okay. So you need to press all the keys. Q. Oh, that's the bomb. Bomb doors is Q. And I'm assuming that maybe page up and page down. So, page up, page down. Maybe if we alt mode, page up, page down. Nothing. Man, so I don't, I think this is a dysfunctional one. I don't think it'll, I don't think this works. Man, that's a shame. Such a pretty Zeppelin, too. See, what I'm gonna do is I'm probably gonna crash my friend's server here. So that was the first one, this was the second one, so now we're gonna check out the third one here. And they keep going up in brick count, even though this one looks to be smaller than all three. The first one was pretty big, it was the biggest. The second one was the sm uh, the medium, and then this is the smallest. But, um, each one, when they go the small ways, gets bigger in brick count. For example, uh, this one's 7,000, the other one was 3,000, the other one was 2,000. So, they keep getting up in, uh, things. I think this is like a news television blimp. KWA. I don't know what KWA is, but... KWA. Uh, it might just be something that someone put there. But it's still pretty nice. So, uh, lo it looks like we had some nice lights and a nice cockpit here. With a beautiful view. Staff only. Uh, kind of looks like an LG. <laughs> LG screens. Um, and then, so, uh, we'll, we'll just. I guess we'll have to check it out, uh, when we get down there. And I guess this is for the reserved back here in the private lounge. Then of course there's the door there. So what's up here? Let's check what's up here. Uh, it looks like it's a very nice. Wow, it's a very nice, lovely airship. You come up here and you have a walkway, the doorways to all the rooms, which are all furnished. That's very nice. And then all the way back here, we got an entire movie theater and stuff. That's quite massive with the projector um, for the movie and then of course the stage 
thing. And it looks like there might be an, a little thing back here. This is the storage closet for storage needs. And then back here... Uh, this, uh, back here looks like... That's the rearmost of the of the entire blimp is this door thing here. Uh, uh, so then we come over here. So that's the hallways. And looks like there's also some very nice dining area up here and over there. And then up here we got Ooh, we got a pool table in here. That's cool. That's really cool. Pool table, side view windows, uh looks like some lounge area. Uh, some more dinner, dining area, the wine bar, complete with all the stuff, necessities. Toilets, men, women, some nice artwork. What's behind this door? Ah, so here's your, here's your crew cabins, or staff quarters, here. So, looks like you can fit about two staff here. And is there anything else? Anywhere? I don't think so. So, it looks like that's what that is. Uh, that's pretty cool. So, it's the LZ-127 Brick Zeppelin. So, this looks really nice. Um, I'm excited to try this out. I think it will work. Uh, and then, of course, you know, everything has to be complete with your captain and your pilot. So, uh, let's... <laughs> Looks like that creation is way too big for one person to spawn in. So it looks like I'm gonna have to pick a different mm, thing. Dang it, bro. Yeah, that sucks, bro. That sucks so bad, bro. Okay, so. Looks like, out of all these, um, I'm really mad about some of these because some of them work, some of them don't work. That looks the coolest, but I don't know. Uh, what was it? Uh, oh, can I just do this? Ah, here we go. This works. So I don't think there's many zeppelins on here. Uh, well, we can do the Hindenburg. Let's hope I don't get yelled at by YouTube for doing that. There's the airship from um, Henry Stickman. I actually do have the airship. Uh, I don't know if you guys knew that. I'll show it to you if you'd like, but it's quite big. Uh, so, we'll just we'll just do our new Hindenburg one here. Let's check out the Hindenburg. It's quite massive. 1,000 bricks though. 1,500. That's, that's not 7,000. I don't think this will have interior if it's that little uh, brick count. So here's the walkway. Of course, there's no gas cells because that would be big, big bricks. Um, and then, of course, in real life, you'd go to the sidecars. Which is, if that's all sidecars, that's a lot of sidecars. And then here's the back, back here. So let's go check out the bottom. Uh, if I remember correctly, which I'm pretty knowledgeable with my planes. There's supposed to be windows, so hopefully this will have an interior. So, looks like this is the thing. Up here. And then in here, there's no interior. No interior. So, uh, let's just spawn this in. Let's just spawn it in. And let's hope that it's not dead. So this is the point where we god mode it. It's also the point where we god mode the creation. And let's just... This is a big creation. Oh, wait, I saw something. Oh, what's that? Alright, so let's just fly all the way out here. Uh, Alright, so... Let's go with... All the <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
don't think that was supposed to happen. It works! It works! But it's not good. Not really. Uh oh. No. So, we're just gonna go here. So, the Hindenburg. I'll just control C this because this is probably really hard to copy. Uh, I'll put into the thing. There's my. Uh, you saw my hours, didn't you? So, we're going to control V and let's see what we can find. We're going to put in Hindenburg. Uh, here's the remastered version. See if we can find some with uh, interior. Infinity Tower, that's a lot. Uh, small, tiny Hindenburg. Battleship Hindenburg, Hindenburg, Hindenburg. We'll go with this one, and just because we'll go with this one. Uh, this works, but it's not working too well for us right now, so we'll just not with it. This is 2000 Burk Hindenburg, and it already looks like it has an interior in it. So, we'll check out the interior. Uh, I guess we'll check out the interior when we get to it, but just in case. So here's the main thing. Where the, pe the people would board back here, actually. Uh, but anyways, they go up, and I think they board... Uh, no, they board here. They board here. Board down here. So, that's cool. Uh, so they board uh, over here. Alright, you know what? I'm, I'm just not going to show anything. We're going we're gonna to spawn this bad boy in. And we're going to enjoy this. Uh-oh. Well, I'll say we were. Alright. So, here's the Hindenburg. There's a lot of detonation, so number three doesn't do anything. So that's great. Um, thinking everything's going to be in alt mode. Most things are probably going to be in alt mode. So the real Hindenburg would actually have some sidecars on the side. Um, uh-oh. Well, that wasn't natural. Let's just put this thing on the road. Um, just, just like, uh, just like right here. Right. To prevent it from rolling, we might as well put it, you know, just like that. It's like right, right, uh, right here. Right. Almost. Did I get it? I think I did. No, oh, we're just gonna put it like right here. Okay. Alright, so. Let's just. Uh, mm, my god. How do we get this up in the air? <laughs>
Oh, it's lagging too. Oh, oh my god. Alright, well, that was a disaster. Does this have interior? Oh, it does! It does! It actually has interior! And it's got the side cars too! Yo! We got everything here, boys. Hindenburg. H I N D E N B U R G. In erg. In erg. So. <laughs> maybe this thing won't be as laggy. So it's all colorized. Uh, hopefully you don't mind that. It's all colorized though. I guess that's just to prevent like copyright claim and uh, not very good stuff like that. And then of course, if you didn't know. Uh, the cabins were inside of the, you know, big, uh, big, uh, rigid body structure, uh, in here. They were a big block, pretty much. And then the gas cells were defined by, uh, all this stuff here, and then the ailerons and whatnot. So, uh, let's just, um, let's just spawn in the vehicle and see what happens. So, right off the bat. We're experiencing some issues, so we're going to control G this. Plate fell off. I don't know if that was an intentional. Hopefully not. Okay, so we're gonna put ourselves right in here. So, over here is the view from when you're in the sky. This is the dining area right here. Uh, yeah. And uh, so the dining area, and if we're going down here. We got ourselves, and this is not accurate to the Hindenburg at all, actually. Uh, actually, I think it might be. This might be the bottom layer, which means there's a top layer, actually. But I think this is not, because there's... Anyways, so, um, normally there'd be a grand piano in a dining room, and then there'd be this, but stuck together, I guess, for budget cost and for brick count. Uh, over here is the cabins. Of course, you got the bathroom. Very important. They don't open. Uh, and you got your cabins one, two, and three. So if you are, uh, you know, four, five, or six, you're gonna have to go sleep with the dogs tonight in the doghouse. So, uh, let's go see if there's anything else in the ship. So, uh, so looks like. Wow. Everything's tilted. Um. Anyways, yeah, so here's the cabins, one, two, three, and then the bathroom here. Uh, there's me. And then, I don't think, yeah, there's, there's nothing else at all, anywhere. Uh, so let's just go check out the main room down here. Uh, this is the control car, uh, so we got our seats, and the driver's seat, and then, uh, of course, the name. So, I mean, if I'm being honest, it's not too bad. It's, it's not, it's better than the other Hindenburg attempts. Um, 
if I'm if for all I'm concerned, it's not that bad, right? It's it's pretty good. The only thing I have to say against it, um, it doesn't really fly too well. And that's the bad thing about this. I want interior space with it also flying well, so that cannot be done. This, we'll, we'll keep it for now. This can be flown, but doesn't really have anything. Now this, uh oh, wrong. This right here, this is the coolest one. S but it's 7,000 bricks, right? That's what makes it so bad. But it's cool, because I'll, 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 hopefully I'll, I've uh, got kittens. The server can actually hold it. Um, it's if uh, the thing, yeah. So, unfortunately, I can't spawn that in for you guys to see. But it's very cool. Uh, I was able to spawn it in one time. It was very cool. So we're just gonna insert up. Uh, blimp. Let's see what we can find. So we got a blimp here. That doesn't look that bad. Uh, this is half Hindenburg, half Hindenburg. Uh, zero stars. This actually looks very nice. Um, most of these don't have any stars at all. Like, at all. Um, uh, but, most of these look promising. Don't look bad. No lag blimp. That looks thing. It's pretty good. Uh, this is the Hindenburg. This is the airship. This is a light airship. This is a whatever airplane. Hindenburg. That looks cool. Hindenburg. You know, we'll we'll, we'll add the Hindenburg. Add it. Uh, let's see. We'll go with one more. We'll go with. There's a good year blimp. It doesn't look that bad. We'll go with the highest rating star count. So this one. And then we'll go check these out. So this is the Hinden, the the Hinden brick, Hinden brick. So let's check this out. Hinden brick. Oh, uh, the swastika. Or actually, no, that's not swastika. That's the German sign, I think. Emblem. I don't know. Um, I don't know my country's looks or anything. So looks like we also got the bombers. It's a bomber pl uh, bomber thing. This is the back. Ag ag I don't even know. I guess that means bomb. I don't know. And then an entire thing over here. This looks cool. So we got halt, throttle, and full throttle. We got pitch up, pitch down, roll right, roll left, yaw right, yaw left. That's pretty good. Hindenburg looks pretty good. And it's only 2,000 bricks. For 2,000 bricks, you can't go wrong. 7,000 bricks. And... Oh, it shouldn't be too bad. Right, right. So this is the hidden brick. So... How do we... No? Um... Number four. Ah, page up. Page up is spins the propellers. What about page down? Oh, page up. We're gonna have to check this thing out. Word for word. Alright, so page up and page down. Page up and page down. Aha and aha. So, maybe we have to have alt mode on. So, alt. Page up. Put the propellers. No. Page down. No. Steering. Ah. Uh, looks like a defect, boys. Ah, oh, I hate defects. Man, how could it have gotten all these stars if it doesn't even work? So, it says W to thrust. Normal plus alt mode. And yeah. A, D, and alt. So you have to have alt to steer, and yeah. 
Mouse left. Yeah, I uh, toast toast. What happened? I had to go. Okay. Don't be a dude. Oh, you serious? Um, if I see later you. Uh, okay. Then you wanna go. I see later you, uh, night. Um. Bye. Good night. Okay, bye. Anyways, guys, now that we can, now we can check out this this thing right here, cause we can spawn it in. Now let's check it out. Uh -oh. All right, then. as we can see. the switches. This will work out fine then. Right, right. This will work out fine. Eee. Eee. Right. So, let's check out how to use this. The door's on this side, over here. That's for the employees only. Let's open this. That's cool. Now, let's go up here and check out the inside. Let's close it for good sakes. That's cool. So, as you can see here, there's bombs all along the bound. Bound? Bound? Right. Life Good TVs. This is pretty much where the people would take. This is where they'd sit. Right when they're about to take off. This is a staff only box. So we're gonna open that up. We're going to go lights. Perfect. Uh uh oh. Alright. Um we're gonna free cam our way back in here. Uh just like so. So like we said, lights. So we're gonna close the door. Staff only door. We're gonna close that. It's very laggy with the lights on, but it lets us see everything better. So back here, this is the special lounge, uh, I should say, I guess you could say lounge area for the, you know, employees only, right? Or not the employees, for the rich class only. And they get to see the entire back of the airship with the lights back there flinking. Um, so that's there. And then, of course, all the other people, they would have to, you know, sit there when they're taking off. So up the stairs, right over here, we got the main hall. And I, this is pretty cool. This is a pretty cool main hall. So you go over here, and we'll start over here. We'll, we'll start, we'll start from back here, actually. We'll start from back. So back here is the cabins. Uh, each one is fully furnished with sliding doors. This is what it looks like. You got a bed, you got a little closet, and a lamp um, for everyone, for everyone's comfort. Uh, each one, again, fully furnished, and they have sort of the same concept for each one. Uh, so that's pretty cool. And then back here is the movie theater. Yes, a movie theater on a Zeppelin. So while you're, while I'm, you know, on your very, very long cruise to wherever you're gonna go, you can watch a movie. Or, you can watch a play, like a little skit that you can watch. Uh, and, you know, there's curtains and everything, and it's pretty cool. And then back here, of course, is, um, special areas for the staff. This is the storage area. And then back here is the, uh, the, you know, the, this is, this is the back end of the ship. Uh, you can see everything back there. Um, the crew goes back there sometimes every once in a while to just go check on uh, if, you know, that's where they back up to. And that's right next to the cabins. So, uh, movies usually take place around like 6 and 7 o'clock. So that way people sleeping has some time to get ready. So that way the movie when it's over, they can just go to bed. Um, so that's pretty cool. And then back here, if we're walking back here, 
we turn right or left, we have some more seating for everyone to go sit at, because, you know, you kind of need to. On a Zeppelin, this is where you can eat food. Um, there's some nice, like, book stuff in the back here. And then up here, uh, there's some more dining room seating, some bit large table, small table, dining room table, stuff like that. Uh, you also got some windows on the sides, but this, this is also really cool. This is the pool table. Uh, normal pool tables, they can weigh up to, you know, a lot of, a lot of pounds, right? But this one's made out of aluminum and carbon fiber. And so it's very lightweight, and you can play pool with your buddies. Uh, and right now, I think it's set up as 8-ball, so you can play some 8-ball with your buddies. Uh, and I'm assuming the sticks would be somewhere around here. I don't know. Uh, and there's more seating back there. This is the bar, right here. So we got some beautiful, beautiful food and drink that's being served. Uh, walk up bar. So again, there's more windows. This is this is pretty much where the passengers come to look out uh, the windows area, because you know there is some there is some windows down there, uh, down here. You know, just you know, pop back. This is a very good area to look at windows. Um, but the best view that I think most of the passengers enjoy is, of course, when they're playing with their buddies and friends and stuff and they want to look down. Um, so that's nice. And then you got some more seating again with some more windows. Uh, and then back here we got the toilets. So this is for the men back here. And then this is for the women right there. And again, that nice mural. Uh, this is for the staff only. This is actually, there's a sign on the wall. Well, it appears like I think this is a good enough time to exit the game. So, thank you for watching.